today we are not going to waste time we're jumping straight in to day six yes because look like the more of these i have that i've already made and prepared and ready i do not need to stress about when i need to edit upload all those kind of stuff like it just makes my life so much easier so i'm gonna jump straight into oh i need to open the scripture before i start recording because i'm trying to make sure that everybody on tiktok gets most of most of the um the, the revelations i'm sharing um of the devotional but yeah anyway like just comment down in the comment section how this devotional has really been inspiring your faith inspiring you to love others and just like you know some encouragement <laughs> um and just testify about what god is doing if there's anything that god is doing while you are you know faithfully um disciplinary following this devotional but anyway um yeah i think i'm gonna start recording now day six so we're gonna move and shift a little bit from um yes not not it's not even shifting but like we're gonna talk about how love does not dishonor you know and this is a very very important thing and i feel like because honor is such a it's such a dignity related issue in life like when you honor somebody you show them love and um i think simply put like dishonor in itself is disrespect it's disgrace it is and it, it is something that you know you do not want to 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 have and love basically does not shame it does not uh, disgrace somebody dishonor is the opposite of honor as you've already uh, picked that up which is holding somebody at high esteem like when you honor somebody you give them like a respect that is beyond like it's just it's very difficult to explain this but I did do um, um, a, a, what do you call this thing I read uh, Pastor Russell's book um, the honor key incredible it explains honor so well I cannot like put it in a nutshell right now but um, I just feel like maybe I should you know continue with the devotion um, when you just honor you see people as lower than yourself um, it's when you fancy yourself being more important or having more privilege and this is something that like yesterday's devotional kind of touched on a bit especially the scripture that I read where you should not be too proud and you should not consider yourself of, of high esteem but you cannot extend your your hand to another and the Lord led me to read um, uh, Proverbs 11 verse 2 which says when pride comes then comes disgrace but with humility comes a wisdom and a great example of this kind of dishonoring um, I feel like obviously of this kind of dishonoring was no no Noah's sons in um, um, Genesis 9 verse 22 uh, 27 that speaks about like it just speaks about how these boys they saw his dad and then they looked at his dad the dad was naked or was drunk whatever just go read this, the story for yourself but one of the most important things I've learned about love is that love is vulnerable and hence it requires honor because love is such a, a space where all of us are free and we are open and this is in all kinds of relationship it genuinely requires honor and I just want you today to really really think about it do I honor the people that I love whether it be your parents your family your, your friends your sisters your siblings I've been saying the same thing multiple times but do you honor those people and how does that honor look like for you yeah and that is all for today's devotional so obviously I'm gonna add in a little bit more detail for the people that are on YouTube <laughs> because I love you guys so much I feel like my YouTube family is um, it's the core of where really it all started so i have a very close relationship and i really love longer videos and that's one of the reasons why i enjoy like recording youtube videos um because i just like talking to myself and looking at myself but anyway um so in lot's story um the most interesting thing about it and why like the lord i think revealed to me uh that love is vulnerable is because when you love somebody we have a tendency of letting our guard down and i think that's the point um i will explain this in a very interesting way i had a, a podcast a couple of days ago where the lord spoke to me while i don't know i think i was in i was in my devotionals in the morning and he spoke to me and he was like lynn your walls are up uh you need to let down your walls 
and I was like, but God, I've been safe for so long. What do you mean I need to let down my walls? My walls are bent out. You know I could do anything for you, Lord. I'm like, I'm a Peter. Like, honestly, if there was a biblical character that you can use to describe me that was one of the disciples, it would be Peter. Because I am like, where you go, I will go, Lord. If you were to die today, sir, I will die with you. <laughs> and then sometimes when the situation comes, I am most likely to be hiding but obviously like Holy Spirit is helping me with all of that and I'm like really getting back into it but like just speaking about how that uh, that vulnerability allows for love to flow it makes it all the more important why honor is important because when there is dishonor, just as like the Proverbs scripture speaks about there is disgrace and they um, it brings embarrassment and humiliation when you do not honor the person that you love or the people that you love and this is why it's so important like i understand why like love does not dishonor because when you love somebody you will do every single thing to protect them every single thing possible to protect their image to protect themselves from themselves like it's just there's so much that people are willing to do like you or you always go the extra mile for the people you love and i feel like when we allow ourselves to fully receive that revelation of love that god really intends for us to be extending we know what to do i don't know if you're like me me i am a practical person me god knows that jesus as long as you do not give me the steps of how i'm supposed to do this where i am going to struggle because i need to know like why am i moving like this why am I going there? I need to know the why behind my action. And this description of love, wow, this is so powerful. This description of love and why God gave us a description of what love is and what love isn't is because he requires of us to have, like to put love into action, to really do love not just say love like a lot of us say love but don't do it you know a lot of us say I honor you I respect you I love you you are amazing but we do not show it in our actions we do not show it and I've I've, I've been learning in the last couple of days I mean yeah don't know months yeah it's been like a month or so like where the Lord has really been speaking into my life about honoring the people that love me and um, showing them love you know and just like doing things that they would not traditionally expect from me so I started randomly buying my friends gifts when I generally feel like oh my friend is so exhausted this would be nice for them to have or like I go buy something for myself and I'm like my friend would like this or like I see sometimes it's just obedience but <laughs> you know the point is uh, the lord is really speaking into that area of my life where he's just like you need to step out and love people the way i want you to love them and also the way that they are loving you because i have people in my life that love me so much and because i did not grow up with love guys Gunzima. <laughs> it's really tough to just sit there and just receive <laughs> it's like um are you sure it's me are you sure i am the one are you sure it's not my friend come on now huh is it really me so yeah it's been really quite incredible to witness and be a part of that and god is just showing up and showing off so yeah let's just honor each other check out the honor key guys i'm being super genuine check out that review of that book it was incredible it was amazing like i learned so much from honor because honor is not title it is a way of life like i said it is about the dignity of a person it has very little to do with a title um it has little to do with leadership it has everything to do with humanity and and love because we're not picky we're children of god this is gonna be a very long devotional if i keep keep talking guys we're gonna be here forever but anyway don't forget to like comment share and subscribe for those that are on youtube then if you are on the podcast make sure you share leave a comment say something you know do the things be nice be kind ah i'll see you guys tomorrow and have a blessed day and love your people lots of love in my heart lots of love in my heart